The other thing that being part of the Broncos taught me was the value of teamwork. Uh, I've talked about the value of, of, of setting goals, but quite often to achieve those goals, you need to call on your teammates, uh, and, and in your case, fellow councillors and workers on the council to get those goals done. And in that is the thing that we call teamwork. Um, let's understand one thing, within, within the framework of any team, uh, no one individual is more important than the, 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 the collective group or the collective outcomes that are trying to be achieved. Uh, and teamwork of, oftentimes involves a certain level of compromise. And to compromise means that you've got to give some ground, uh, to, to, to give a little bit away to get a, a common goal achieved. So I think whenever we think about teamwork, one of the things you're going to have to get your head around very quickly is the fact that yes, you feel very strongly about your ideas, your goals, your objectives, but so does everybody else. And somewhere in the middle of all of that, what has to happen is a meeting of the minds, a compromise of sorts, to get as close to everybody's outcomes that they're, they're, they're looking to achieve. That's a very difficult thing to do, and it takes an enormous amount of discipline in terms of accepting that your ideas aren't always exactly what everybody else's are, but there is always common ground. And I think what, has, what always has to be the overriding factor in anything to do with teamwork and goals and all of that is knowing what the overall direction of your team is. Uh, and in that would be your local council. What does that council really stand for? And in that, every decision, every piece of goal, every, every dream, everything that's part of that has to be always pointing in that same direction. Uh, and in that has to be a real willingness of every component of that team or every member of that team to give a bit, to always be looking in the one direction.